everyone, this is David from the Outbreak team and this is the first Outbreak development update. So since this is the first video, I'm going to explain a little bit what will be in those updates. In each video, we're going to cover three topics. We're going to cover production, design and technology. So on the production, we're going to do a brief update on how the project is going in general. On the design part, we're going to share about our latest development on everything that is creative uh, like the world design, system design, game design. And finally, in the technology part, we're going to talk a little bit about what we do behind the scene to kind of pull everything together to make Outbreak. So let's jump right in with the first update on production side. All the third-party developers are currently working with us. We have hired a 3D artist, a VFX team and a network programming team to build all the external systems that will make Outbreak. We also have updated our Trello page where you can see what we're working on right now and what are our next priorities. This page is public, feel free to go check it out. The link is going to be in the description below. And finally, Mark and I have consolidated all our game design documents into one single document. Uh, this will help us have a clear vision of the entire scope of the game and enable us to make like better decisions on what to prioritize in the future. So second part of this video, design, uh, on my side, on, I'm working on the interstates right now. So it's finding a really good design recipe on what the roads will look like uh, and like doing the first uh, kind of draft of where they will be in the world. I'm working mostly in the northwest of the whole map right now. Uh, it's going pretty well right now. I'm not encountering any issue on that. So it's going very well and it's going to give us a very nice a uh, sense of scale really rapidly. Uh, our 3D artist Mitch that joined our team recently uh, has been starting to deliver some parts of the Dominator 3 retake he's doing. And finally on the tech side Mark has been working extremely hard on upgrading the whole Outbreak project to a new render pipeline. So this means better graphic and better FPS in game. Right now we have nothing to show specifically about this but we are very hopeful that in the next update we're gonna be able to show some pretty cool graphics. So that's it for the first development update. We want to make sure that our video stays short and to the point so we can focus most of our time on developing the game. If you have any question or feedback about the game or even about those dev vlogs, feel free to reach out to us in our Discord or in the comment below. Thanks everybody and see you next time.